In this lesson, we'll cover creating switch systems. So you may ask, well, what is a switch system and how is it different than a lighting circuit? Well, a lighting circuit is a way to actually connect your lights, including switches, to a circuit of how those will be powered. However, maybe that switch doesn't control all the lights, but it's powered within that circuit. The switch system is a way to define which lights are controlled by what switch. So how do we create this switch system? Well, let's zoom in on the upper left room within our Revit project. Currently, we have a circuit defined, which we can see by the circuit wires in the upper left for the six lights on the left going to the sensor switch on the wall on the bottom. But what if there was another switch, let's say on the opposite wall, and let's say the switch on the bottom actually only controls the three lights or four lights on the bottom and not the other two on the top. How can I depict that? And one way is by drawing a switch system. To create the switch system, let's first of all just choose one of the actual lights that'll be connected to the switch. Now, keep in mind, this switch system is totally independent of any circuit and wiring that's already drawn. With this light selected, since it does not belong to a switch system, you see switch in the upper right under create systems. Go ahead and click switch. Now this creates the system. The next thing I want to do is add the switch. So on the system tools area of the ribbon, you have a select switch icon. Go ahead and select that and then simply select the switch below these lights. That will draw a dashed line representing which light is controlled by which switch. Now, if you want to add the other lights to this switch system, simply click Edit Switch System on the ribbon. And now we can use the Add to System button on the ribbon to add the other lights to this switch. And I'll just simply select the four lights that I want to be controlled by this switch. When done, choose Finish Editing System. This will actually define the system now for that switch. To see this information, simply click on one of your lights with the light selected on the tabs at the very top right, choose Switch System. This will then display the system switch and also display the other lights that are also connected to this switch. To deselect, just select anywhere in the background. So as a review, in this lesson, we covered how to create switch systems. We talked about the differences between the switch system and the lighting circuit, where the lighting circuit is basically everything that is connected together within that circuit to be powered. However, the switch system is which switch controls what lights, because maybe there are multiple lights within the circuit, but the switch only controls some of those lights. So we need to define that by creating a switch system. To create the switch system, we looked at selecting a light, then choosing the Generate or Create Switch System from the ribbon. From there, we added the switch, and then we added additional lamps or lights to the switch system.